Okay, these guys definitely come off like they're trying hard and succeeding, by the way. They've got 10 million subs on YouTube, but they are trying. They've got the Hollywood sign in the background there. They remind me of that stereotypical forced-to-be-perfect family that you saw in uh, Step Brothers. Remember Will's brother in Step Brothers? Two, three, four, bum. <laughs> She's got a smile that it seems to me Reminds me of childhood memories She's got eyes of the bluest skies As if they thought of rain Flat. It's so flat. I can't even, I don't even know. You don't even look good while you're singing. The worst thing I've ever heard. Except I have a feeling it's the woman who's the controller in this relationship. She's definitely the one steering this ship. This guy doesn't have the look. He does look kind of creepy, though. He does look like somebody who... How can I put this? He looks like somebody who, if I saw someone I cared about sitting next to him at a bar, I'd definitely want to make sure there was a lid on their drink. That's all I'm saying. We're all so humble, we're like, we're all fine. We're all so humble. What if humble. you don't know, like, which one is the number? The girl who I found most attractive was Jordan. She has a great personality and she's confident. Dope. Watching this guy is like going through a crazy fractal for me because... I watch, you know, I start off watching YouTubers with more subscribers and they're doing cooler stuff and cooler stuff. And then I look at who has the most subscribers and it's someone doing the same thing as me. It just starts over. This guy might edit his videos better than I do, but at least with me you don't have to watch me wear that big, dorky, totally unnecessary headset. It's been an amazing camp. 12 days out, you're fighting Nate Robinson, the three-time NBA slam dunk champion. He's an athlete. He's played a little college football too, man. That seems to be the narrative against you. Yo, I, that's why it's a perfect fight is because everyone thinks the athlete is going to beat the pretty boy YouTuber. But in 12 days, they're going to see how good of an athlete I am. And they're going to see that being an athlete in boxing really doesn't matter. This man is a genius. This guy's talking about himself like he's a seasoned veteran. I don't know, this fight's about a 36-year-old former NBA basketball player versus YouTuber Jake Paul in a boxing match. The odds makers have Jake Paul as the favorite, but I can't go against the former pro, actual pro athlete. I think, you know, if everything makes sense, the former pro athlete should smoke Jake Paul, right? Don't come crying to me if you make the bet and I end up looking stupid, but... That's what I would go with. Mm -hmm. 